Hello everyone, today in front of me I have Huawei Nova 10 SE and in this video we would like to demonstrate how you can set up the parental control function on this device. So to begin with, uh, I will let you know that we are going to use the free application that is called Kidslock. Kidslocks, should, should I spell it correctly? Uh, which we'll get from the app gallery, so let's launch it. At the search bar, type in kids, locks, not like so, not like this, I mean. So here it is. Let's go ahead and install it quickly. Now we can go ahead and launch it. So in here, uh, just that this is going to be the child's phone. Then, uh, well, further choose whether you would like to, uh, I mean, register a new account or if you have one, just enter the pairing code. I'll create a new one. So the parent name is going to be heart. The email is going to be hard reset info came in at gmail.com which is not an option over here I would assume yep so hard reset info gaming at gmail.com I'll answer the password real quick off the screen of course or should I rather say enter the password set the password I mean So after the account has been successfully, well, signed up, now we gotta uh, create our own parent pin code, which will not be known to the child, of course. So I'll go with some very easy one, two, three, four, just as an example. And so I will not forget it myself. From here, you gotta uh, enter the child's name which you're going to supervise, supervise, so I'll name the child Hardy, uh, set the kid's age to be seven, pick this avatar, for example. And from here, uh, we gotta grant it all, grant the kid's locks all kinds of permissions. So let's do exactly that. We'll start with draw over other apps access, which will grant to kids locks. Continue with the usage access. Then proceed with accessibility. I'm not sure exactly what we gotta do over here. So, download it. Install services, kids locks. Switch this toggle on. Then we'll grant it notification access as well. So, <laughs> as I've already said, it's a very tedious job, but needs to be done in order for this app to work properly and apply some strict uh, and hard restrictions really <sighs> next uh, on the agenda is content blocking so we'll activate the admin rights as well and app launch finally so permissions not this one already so seems like the setup has been successfully completed now this device is uh, well getting supervised from here you can set some limit time limit block some apps 
There is also the slow instructions that you can follow if you if it is the, your first time using the app. Mm, so in here you can adjust time, set some data limits, look through the statistics, turn on the mode, different various modes. block, restrict or limit the apps, stop the apps deletion and well what's not really at this point so we have recommend that you try uh, conf configuring and like diving deeper into all the uh, options restrictions and what's not this app has to offer yourself. It's quite a lot of functions should I say and let's say you are a kid who would like to disable it but unless you know the pink code that we set, you will not be able to do so. Alrighty, so that would be it for this video guys. Thank you so much for watching, thank you so much for your attention, and bye bye!